hello and welcome to my channel today i have a very exciting unboxing i have b pack makeup madness uh so this is very cool so this is the second one from the series two so i originally opened up um the pre the other one whose name i can't remember um but now i got the second one so there was two in the makeup madness line and so i'm very happy to have got myself the second one i'm very slowly collecting them all I, I haven't heard anything for a while about the b pack so i don't know i think they must be discontinued or something because there has been nothing about them for a while but considering that i didn't even know they existed like well it's a year ago now <laughs> like i think i think right about the same time i started the channel was the same time i found out that these exist um like literally they were on sale on some online website i bought a couple because they were cheap and I fell in love and the rest is history and now I insist on buying them all. So I only knew that they existed this year but apparently they've been out for a couple of years now. I think this came out in 2020. So yeah. But um, I'm finally getting around to purchase them all. Some of them I, it looks like I don't know if they've made it over here or not because I know especially for the series 2. Uh, series 2 they did a couple of different things. They did the Makeup Madness and then they did um, another one with her hair uh and then they did the usual cool for school kind of ones that you see um the makeup madness i have been able to get from shops um but the one with the hair um it doesn't seem to be made over here i might just get a couple uh because there is a company that i buy from occasionally that do overseas purchases so i was able to get a couple from them but it is obviously a lot harder um because they don't seem to be made over here but the rest have but yeah, you very rarely see these in the shops. So whenever I do, or whenever I see them online in the shops, I do buy them because I absolutely love these dolls. So I'm very happy to finally have this one and I will be opening her up. And depending how long this video is, I will also be opening up um, a couple of the series one um, blind boxes because I got a couple of them as well. Um, and I've been dying to open them. So I might just do it in this video. I don't know, we'll see how long this video is, um, but we'll go from there. So pushing ahead this here is going to be this doll so this one isn't a surprise like the others you know what you're getting with this one so you're getting this doll here um but still it's really fun plus um the other one i got i've actually ended up using the box as kind of like a display case for the dolls that i have collected so far so but it was getting a bit crowded uh hold on i have it beside me so let me just show you just how crowded it's gotten you can see here it has gotten very very crowded so Oh gosh, I'm hitting the camera. So yeah, I needed another one. This is my excuse. I had to get the other one just so I had another display case that I could use. Um, and here it is. So let's open it up. So I'm gonna try and open it at the bottom because I don't wanna risk um, damaging the front, seeing as I'm going to be using it as a display. I mean, it's not the prettiest display case, but it does the job. And I like the way it's kind of like, purpose so that you can also use it as a playset if you so wish and it's all made of cardboard so series one there was a lot of plastic series two i don't think there's any plastic at all apart from the dolls themselves obviously so that's really really awesome so there was a big massive improvement in that regard but anyway let's get on with it shall we guys so i guess let's start with the doll herself so i think you just pull her out oh gosh and this down again so yeah just like that isn't that handy and then this obviously tells you what all you got. So hold on, let me quickly show you the other one that I got from this. Uh, so, and then if you're interested, um, I did do a video on her. So this is what I'm doing now, which is the Glam Girlies. Um, Miss Cara, or sorry, Miss Cara. So this is who I'm doing now. The one I have done previously is Shay Shadows. So that's her. Do I have her on my, yes I do. Here she is. So she's very, very cute. So that was the one I did previously. So if you're interested in seeing that video, I will, if I remember, link it down below. Um, but if not, I'm sure you can find it easily on my channel because I have done a few of these. So here she is. So I'm going to have to try and be gentle opening this because look at this artwork. Isn't it just stunning? So I don't want to damage it. So how do you do? Oh, maybe I could do it from the back. Yeah, there we go. And then that way I don't damage the front. So this must be, or maybe it's, nope, it's not the doll. Never mind does not fit at all. So this looks like um, some makeup. So it does. So let's tear it open. And there's one, two. So this must be the outfit. 
So we have a skirt. So here is our skirt. So it's got it's pink with lots of little stars and then a pink chain and heart. Uh, and then like um, one of those like little clip things there and a belt. So there's the bottom part, the skirt. And now I guess this is going to be the top. Uh, and then it also comes with this here that you can put on because obviously they're getting their makeup done. So I guess you could do like a spa day kind of vibe. Um, so yeah, these give off like Polly Pocket vibes because the outfits are rubber. And there's what the top looks like. So that's very, very cute. So I'll put them to the side for now so I don't lose them. And let's oh, put that aside as well. And let's do this one next. Oh, <laughs> this one's already opening. Goodness me, doesn't want to open. There we go. So let's see. Can I? There we are. All right, so I think this one's the doll. Okay, so this is more makeup. So this looks like the, is it perfume or maybe lipstick? I think it's lipstick. It's like a brown lipstick, interesting. So this must be the doll and it is. So she's actually got two outfits then. So this is the outfit she's wearing currently. She's got this gorgeous dress with little um, diamonds on it. Very, very sweet. Her face is adorable. She's got pink eyeshadow and purple eyes and a purple heart. And then she's also got um, lovely soft hair here, um, which is very different to the like surprise ones. The surprise ones just have plastic hair, um, but this one has a bit of real hair going about. But she's still very, very pretty. And as you can see, she comes with this here because the whole point is that you can attach them to your backpack. Uh, and then she's also got these lovely purple bits, as you can see. So let me just quickly change her outfit, but I think I'll be putting her back in this one because this one is adorable. So I think it's going to end up being my favourite. But just in case uh, I change my mind, let's put her in the second outfit. I think I said nice. There she is in her second outfit. So yeah, I think I prefer her first outfit. But it is very cute. And this is something I've been seeing a lot. A lot of dolls have had this look, which is like the two different type skirts. Um, there's a lot of dolls that have opened um, or have seen that have had this look. So I don't know. Is this like a thing now? Like I haven't actually seen it in the shots for actual people to wear, but I just see so many dolls wearing this kind of style. So I don't know, is this like a thing? <laughs> or maybe it was a thing back in when, in 21 when these were coming out, I don't know. Uh, but yeah, I think I definitely prefer her dress. So anyway, this must be the rest of her accessories. So that's just the right thing that tells you what she comes with. So we don't need that. And before I open up, let me just show you the back. So this is why I want to keep these as like displays because I really loved what they had done so you have like here which is like dressing room so you can do your makeup here and her your hair there i love this chair i would love to own that in person and then this kind of like i guess like the chilling out room and then maybe like the dressing or where you can get changed um so you can maybe get changed while your friends sit on the sofa uh, and then they can tell you what they think of your outfit so that's quite cute so i love how they have repurposes so that once you've taken things out you could actually play and use this so that's really, really sweet. So I'll put that to the side for now and let's see what is in here. So there's quite a few in this one. Wow, there's a lot. So let's start with the biggie. So this one is the perfume. It says BP obviously for um, B pack. And let's open it up. So yeah, this is very, very cute. So you get like this little card that gives you the information. So this is Miss Cara. She loves makeup, uh, makeup brushes. And yeah, one second. Sorry, try not to sneeze there. So yeah, it says Big Pack at the back. So there she is. So all the Series 1 dolls came with this, but not all of the Series 2 do, which is, I think is really kind of sad. I quite enjoy getting these. And then she also comes with like a little makeup bag, which is like miniature, which is quite cute because you can kind of keep the charms and everything in that, which is nice. Uh, but anyway, moving on to the charms themselves. So I imagine these are all like the charms and the um, key ring. So this one here, I imagine this must be nail polish maybe. So let's open it up and see what's inside. So I've gotten a few of this one and I have no idea what it is. It kind of gives, makes me think of like milk bottles, but I don't know. <laughs> what do you guys think? Maybe it's shampoo bottles or something, but it kind of gives me like milk bottles kind of vibes. You know, like whenever you go to like the fair and they have those like bottles lined up so that you try and hit them with the ball. That's what it makes me think of, but there they are. So there's that one. Uh, and then we have this, but I don't know, maybe it's powder or some cream or something. This feels like the ch the actual the key ring, so yeah. So this is quite cool, plus it's actually made of metal, it feels like. 
uh, which again I think the um, series one was just plastic but I can't be, could be wrong so this is you know a step up the fact it's giving us metal so that's really big cute so there's that one so then let's do the next couple of charms so this one here I don't know what that's meant to be maybe like the um, thing for putting on your uh, foundation which makes sense because look what we get so I think with these you can actually there is like a um, a hot and cold effect I could be wrong though so I think that's why you get this but I won't be doing it because I don't really deal with water it's not for me uh, and then we have mascara and what's in the mascara one uh, we have oh one of those um, cameras was it Polaroid cameras they're called I always wanted them as a child I thought they were the coolest thing ever and even now as an adult I think I would really really like them I think it'd be really really cool to own but they're so dear so yeah that's on my wish list someday someday I'll get myself one and finally we have lipstick and what's inside it actual lipsticks there we go we have a little lipstick charm so there we go so the charms themselves are very very cute and the whole point of this is that you can then oh if I don't drop it put the charms on like so like that and then we can put the Polaroid camera on that's there and then we'll put the lipstick on and then I guess we can put that on if we want to there we go and then the doll herself can like hang out at the bottom so where's the bottom bit there we go oh gosh and then you can put her on your backpack and you can have a doll on the go to play with so that's really really cute I do love this idea it's so so sweet and she's so cute the only thing is the clothes aren't held on that well so I'd be kind of worried with like the likes of this here jackets because if you see whenever you lift your arms up you know it shows so I could probably see that potentially getting lost as you go about your day-to-day -day life especially if you are going to school with these and your, your backpacks bumping into things and you know skills a busy place but it's still very very sweet and I do really really love it and then of course you can put I think you can like use this as well so that's what I usually do is I just click it in like that and then that way you can hold on to it like that so that's really really cute and of course we have this here so if you're like me and prefer to have your doll separate and have them on display I guess you could then just but you still want to keep the charms you could just put them in there and keep them safe so that's quite a good idea um so there's that so let me tidy up this table a little bit and then i think i will try and attempt to open up one of the series one big pack dolls be right back and i'm back so i have five of these boxes left so once i open this one i'm gonna have four left so hopefully it's not double so i think what i'll do is i'll open this one and then maybe sometime down the line i'll just go with the last four in one big video um, and hopefully not getting doubles. I've gotten so far two doubles. I've hit that point where I've collected so many now that you know I'm reaching the point of doubles. So let's hope I don't get any more. So this is what series one looked like. This is what started all. This is what started the whole obsession. This is what I saw when I was browsing the internet one day and made the mistake of buying and it started the whole obsession. So that's what they look like. As you can see it's made of plastic so a lot of plastic for series one but like I said they changed that for series two um so this is what so these are the dolls here and this is what it looks like so it's very very cute and let's open it up shall we so this is called school cool and this is series one and it's very loud so there we are so i'm gonna have great fun with my recycling tonight with all this opening and then we open that up and here we have the surprises inside and these look very familiar so I think I might have a double so let me just see which one feels like the doll and then I can just find out so I think this might be a double but let's see just make double sure so where it says sweetie stick so is this the double please don't be a double it's a double in fact I think this is what I opened I think this is my third one of her actually so yeah I've already opened this doll so if you want to see what the rest of this looks like go view my other videos on the big pack dolls because I have already opened this girl in fact yeah she's right over here <laughs> so I'm not going to open the rest of these up um so that's a shame 
kind of disappointed. Um, I mean, she's a cute one to have. I think she's absolutely adorable. So um, what I'm going to do is I will try one more time. And then this one ends up being double. I guess we'll just leave it at that. Because uh, I do want to leave the rest for another video. So here we go. Try it again. <laughs> All right, let's try. Last chance. No doubles. Oh, goodness. Okay. I don't think I recognize this. So I think this might be a new one. But let's just be sure. By starting with the dolls. This here says Sparkle Berry Milk. 100%. Very, very cute. So I feel like this is a new one. Let's find out, shall we? It's a new one. I'm so happy <laughs> okay she is absolutely stunning seriously guys can you not see why i've gotten obsessed with these like look at this girl okay first i'm gonna take off the glasses because i think sunglasses just take away from the doll because why would you want to hide this face look at this gorgeous face look she's got um some candy in her hair or sweets as she called over here we have these little bows which are glittery and yes the glitter does come off just to warn you, I love the hair. It's a mixture of blue and purple. Like if I could get away with it, I would dye my hair with this color. It's so, so pretty. And look at her dress. It's like all these different pigments of colors. You've got pink and yellow and orange and oh, it is absolutely stunning. And it's also glittery. So that's very, very sweet. And then um, we have her, sh she's got like sandals on and they're also different colors. I don't know if the camera will focus. And she's wearing like these kind of tights that are purple uh, with hearts at the knees. So she is just stunning. So let's see what else she comes with. So this is Kawaii Yeet. So I think she was one of the ones I really wanted. I'm so happy I finally have her. Uh, so her favorite things is, um, what's that called with the paper? Um, oh... I cannot remember but she also loves painting so she's quite um artistic quite creative um so that's so that's very very cute um so let's see what else we get so this here is panda ban bonanza <laughs> so that's really really sweet and i think this is like the second outfit so surely the second outfit is not going to be any better than the first outfit so this is really cute so it kind of has the same purpose as that bag where you like you can put everything in it when you're done. And this feels like another skirt. Oh no, it's another dress. Oh, guys, look at this dress. Usually I like one outfit more than the other when I open these, but these ones, I actually love them both equally. Oh, so it's like a checkered dress with like little strawberries at the bottom. That is so, so cute. And then what's the other accessory then? Oh, and then it comes with a jacket. Oh, guys, this is adorable okay so let's try her in her different outfit um i think i still prefer her in her first outfit um but guys this second outfit is so cute i feel like i need to like maybe get another a different doll to wear that maybe i can do that with my double maybe i can have my double wear this because i think it would suit her <laughs> that way i don't feel too bad about having a double <laughs> all right here we go guys so there's the dress on her oh oh i'm in love i'm in love i'm so happy <laughs> and then let's put the jacket on her the only problem is her hair is so big it's making it hard to get the clothes on let's see if i can do this oh by the way hair i think this is as good as i'm gonna get for now okay because the hair is kind of in the way but i don't mind because it's such nice hair so here is her jacket on now guys she's so so pretty i'm so happy <laughs> uh yeah this is worth it <laughs> this was worth getting the double if it meant that i got hurt next okay so let's see what charm she comes with this here it says mascaron is this thing could be like a play on macaron maybe i don't know 
these things again. I still don't know what they are. These time they have strawberries on it. Oh no, if I can show you. No, again, I have no idea what these are. Okay, this feels like the key ring. Oh, so it was metal. I, was, I thought the series one was more plasticky, but no, this is actually metal too. So this is very, very pretty as well. Uh, oh, I love this one, look. <laughs> it looks like a little paint set. And, oh, this also comes with the camera. We're getting a lot of similarities here. And was there not like a third one you got? Or is that it? Maybe just got the two. But just feeling it to make sure. Yeah, I think that's Sam. So let me just put those together so you can see it all together. And then you can see the two of them looking gorgeous together. So here she is with all her little charms on. Uh, plus this here. She is so, so pretty. Um, so yeah, there we go. So these are the two dolls I got today. So we got our Series 2 um, Makeup Madness doll and our Series 1 doll. They are just and they match so well they're both so pastel and beautiful I am so in love they are going to look amazing on display I love them so much can't you see guys can't you see why I fall in love with this series um, like I'm not normally in the dolls like this but these have just they've stolen my heart <laughs> uh, so yeah I, I have to collect them all I'm so happy to have another new one uh, in fact, let me see, can I find the guide? Here's the guide. So that we can find out a bit more about who we got. Okay, so this is the series one guide. Um, so can I find her? Is that her? I don't know what she called. Yeah, Kawaii. So she is this one here from the Sweeties. So who, hmm, hold on a second. So I get both of the sweeties. So I literally opened one after the other, the both of the sweeties line. And she's a rare guy, so that's pretty awesome. So I got I opened up a, a cool, which I don't know if that's like hard to get or what. And then I opened a rare. So she's a rare, so that's very, very great that I got her. So can I remember who I still have to get? I think I don't have any of the sporties. Or no, I have Workout Wendy, but I don't have Rara. Um I think think I had the Beachy Babes. I'm gonna have to go through these again. I don't have Re Rena Reef, but I believe she is an exclusive. So she's gonna be a hard one to find, but yeah. So these were the ones you could get. So I'm very, very happy I got this girl here. She was one of my top ones that I wanted. So I'm so happy to have her. And then that just shows you them in better detail. So there's our girls there, looking absolutely adorable um so yeah i guess this must be like milk maybe maybe it's like a strawberry milk is what that's kind of giving off so there we go guys i'm so so happy with my with my um openings today uh so let me know in the comments down below which one was your favorite out of the two is it the series one girl or the series two um makeup man this girl uh also uh, if you would like to see more of this i have a I will make myself up a big playlist because I've done so many of these now I may as well just do a playlist for them. So I will make up a playlist and I will try and remember to link it down below for you guys. Um, and maybe at the end of the video I might try and link it in and I'm still learning how to do the whole YouTube thing. Um, but yes I'll try and do that there. Um, but yes if you'd like to see more because like I said I have three more of these ones to open up for series one. So stay tuned for that. Subscribe if you want to see that. And even if you're not into the B pack dolls, if you're into other dolls or other toys or even a bit of crafting, again, subscribe because that is what I do. That is what my channel is all about. So anyway, I hope you enjoy this video and I will hopefully see you in the next one. Bye.